for a Funko Pop review. Mm. Just a second. Mm -mm -mm. I'll be right back. Hello everybody, welcome back to Judge Jack. Are you all done with your snack, Jack? Are you uh, ready to make a video now? I suppose so. Why, do you have any more? <laughs> Very funny. What are we going to do today? We're doing a Funko Pop review. Yay! Yes, and I think it's pretty obvious who we're going to be reviewing, but just in case you haven't caught on, Jack, why don't you tell them who it is? Alright, it's the ad icon, Twinkie the Kid. Yeah! Oh! It's Twinkie the Kid! Wow! Howdy, partners! Come on to Hostess Twinkie Town! Yep, that's right. Twinkie the Kid, the ad icon or mascot for the Hostess Snack Twinkies. He is a Target exclusive. He glows in the dark and uh, he looks pretty cool. So how about we pull him right out of that box and get a closer look? Yes, please. So, what do you think of this guy, Jack? I think he's pretty cool. Uh, not really into cowboys, but I'm into Twinkies. <laughs> All right. Yay, Twinkies! So, the Twinkie the Kid mascot came out in 1971 on all the packaging for Twinkies and was even used in some commercials. And as you can see, Jack, don't eat the Twinkie. You've had enough for one day. Oh, come on. Besides, that's Dad's snack for later. That's my dessert, man. That's messed up. Lay off me, I'm starving! I'm fine. <laughs> Anyways, as I was saying, he was used in the Twinkie commercials, and uh, as you can see, he was some sort of wrangler or cowboy wearing boots, gloves, a uh, kerchief. Kerchief is a really weird word to me. I don't know why. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. And a 10 gallon hat. There were actually some other lesser known hostess mascots too. There was Captain Cupcake, Fruit Pie the Magician, and Chauncey Chocodile. Jack loves the name Chauncey, don't you? <laughs> Anywho, Chauncey was basically a mascot for a chocolate covered Twinkie. So that's pretty cool. Uh, Fruit Pie the Magician, I have actually seen the most without ever even realizing it. That's kind of weird, but um, hopefully I'm showing you everything I mean through pictures. What do you think of these mascots, Jack? I don't know. I think I just like to have the snack. The chocolate-covered Twinkie sounds the best. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Uh, so anyways, there is also a Chase version of Twinkie the Kid, and I think it just has a different outfit on. Uh, but they both glow in the dark, and I will hopefully throw a picture up of the glow as well. Although I don't know why he glows. Why does a Twinkie need the glow in the dark? That's weird. <laughs> Am I not thinking of something? Like, why would that even be necessary? I'm not knocking it, just not sure if I'm missing something. So, guys, let me know what you think. I wouldn't even want to eat anything that glows in the dark, but to be honest, I was never really much of a fan of Twinkies anyways. Uh, they had one with, like, a strawberry jelly in it back in the day. That was okay, but I never really had them much either. I really think Jack, though, has taken quite a liking to them. Uh, so, guess what, Jack? What? You get to keep this guy. <sighs> Yee! That never gets any less weird for me. <laughs> <laughs> Awkward. All right, Jack, what's the final verdict for Twinkie the Kid? <laughs> All right, okay. <laughs> I guess that's an approval. Okay, guys, another huge thank you to everybody for watching. If you like this review, please give it a thumbs up. Let us know if you have or you plan to pick this guy up. Let us know how you feel about Twinkies in general. Love them, hate them, and all that good stuff. And if you want to join this particular kid's jury, Jack, tell him what to do. Slam that gavel down on the subscribe button. Smell you later. <laughs>